Chesselor has us looking fabulous and picture perfect and I'll be showing you her in two colors in 17 23 R8 and in the color 32 31 Hi my friends welcome so I'll be showing you picture perfect here by Tresselor in two colors and I have to say I love both colors that I had chose. I have partnered up with Tresselor to bring you guys this review on this beautiful style. I have been wanting to get my hands on this one for a while. This girl has been out for a little while. I have always wanted her and being a wig wearer I knew that this one was most definitely picture perfect. <laughs> but just because I know Tressalore and I know their lace fronts and their mono tops, they are very, very realistic. They are also very comfortable. When I saw Picture Perfect, I was like, oh, I got to get that one. If you guys are a wig wearer, you get that. This color 1723R8 is a new one for me. And I am so pleasantly surprised and happy with this color. The color 1723R8 is a beige blonde and auburn blended with medium brown roots. Another gorgeous color. I almost want to say, I almost want to say that this is my favorite color so far. I think it's because of how realistic it is. I have already wore this one out several times. I even wore it to the zoo with my family the other night. I, it was so cold outside. We went to the zoo and we had an amazing time. They had all the Christmas lights and everything out and I wore a little sock out with her and she was so, so cute. But this one is, this color is so realistic. It's like if you are a brunette and you go to a salon and you have a bunch of highlights put in there, highlights and low lights. It's just so perfectly blended and natural looking. I'm not completely blonde and I'm not completely brunette. I just... Oh gosh, guys, this color is so, so beautiful. It's just so beautiful. I will most definitely be ordering more wigs in this color. Picture Perfect's lace front and mono top gives this style a very natural and realistic look. Let's take a look inside of Picture Perfect's cap. Picture Perfect has this beautiful lace front monofilament top, bendable ear tabs, adjustable straps, felt nape, and she's open weft it throughout the rest of her cap. Let's take a look at her all the way around. I'll be right back wearing Picture Perfect in the color 3231. All right, y'all, here she is in this gorgeous color 3231. Oh, I think I have found a great auburn shade for my skin complexion. It looks amazing. I love this color as well. I love Picture Perfect. I know I keep on saying that, but when I find a wig that I love, I'm going to just express it. I love it. The color 3231 is a medium red with an auburn blend. Beautiful, beautiful color. Oh 
I want to talk a little bit more about Picture Perfect. This one has an average size cap. I have a petite size head measuring 21 inches in circumference. I did use those adjustable straps and tightened it up to fit my petite size head. The length measures between 6 inches to 16 inches on this gorgeous style. She has an 11 inch fringe here. Her crown is 14 and a half inches and her nape is 10 inches and she weighs 5.29 ounces. Picture Perfect also has heat friendly fibers. So you can get in there with your styling tools. You can straighten her or add some curl. And y'all know I love me some curly hair. So I may eventually get in and add some curl, especially to this one, because this one, and this color is just screaming like day night. It's day night hair and a holiday hair, but it's also just gorgeous, straight, feathery layers, the way it goes back and the way it's just it's just a really, really nice style here. I love Picture Perfect. Now with this color, I have not wore her as much as I wore the first one that I showed you guys. And I, that one pretty much I got trained pretty easily. With it being heat friendly, I just rubbed my hands together and got them really, really warm and just kind of just kept training it to go back. So you don't want it falling down in your face like this. So what I normally do is after I've warmed it up some, you can also use a heating tool to kind of hold it back and warm it up as well. But what I normally do is I find which way I want to part it and I flip my head over flip it back and as it's still flipped back like that I use the wig wax by Tressalore. This stuff is great guys. It is wonderful and I spray it on my wigs and then I let that gently fall down and then I just use my fingers to style it back in place and you just look at that amazing hold from this wig wax. Mmm, the smell, it smells so pleasant. Can you just see how amazing that wig wax worked? <laughs> it just holds those fibers so nicely and it also is so easily combed out. After, after I've taken my wig off, I'll put her on my mannequin head and I comb her right out and this stuff comes out so easily. But what it does leave behind is that amazing smell. It gives that wig a fresh, like right out of the salon smell every time I put it on. So I'm very, very pleased with Picture Perfect and of course my new favorite hairspray, the Wig Wax by Tressalore. And then after I've got that in its dried a little bit, I will use just a little bit more. on the parts that I want to hold back. There we go. And then I'll let that dry. And I'm ready to go. Love this stuff, love this stuff. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. But before you go, be sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And come over and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. You can find me at Let's Talk With Kim. Stay well, my friends, and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye, guys.